Hello everybody, this is David or the Divichito Online and today I'm going to bring you guys a game of TDM on the map Hangar 18 which was from the third map pack and today I'm going to be doing episode 3 of kill with all gun categories and today we're going to do shotguns so let's get started our first weapon is going to be the Olympia so let's see how we do well, to start off with, um, I want to tell you guys that the best shotgun for me is the stakeout. Reason why is that I think having a grip on a shotgun or any or even on a assault rifle is good to kill a person better. As you can see, the stakeout doesn't have attachments, so it's a little hard to aim. Like to aim like far and yeah you don't get the kill most times but that's my opinion and then uh, here we go we go to the stakeout you do see that I am gonna get some good kills with it so yeah so let me tell you guys a story about what happened to me <laughs> yesterday well, well, my friend came over. He wanted me to go to the auto zone. I know you guys know what that is. Um, he wanted me to go to auto zone with him. So he was like, "Why don't you ride your motorcycle?" Well, I do have a motorcycle. So I'm like, "All right then." So okay, we go get. The, I go get the motorcycle. It was in the backyard. I go get it. I bring it to the front. I turn it on. I see that it doesn't have gas. So I put some gas on it. Okay, I fill it up with gas. But then it starts leaking. And I'm like, where's it leaking from? So I look in the so I look in the bottom of the motorcycle and then I see that <laughs> it had a what is it a a little hole where it was letting the gas out. So what I had to do was look for this little I don't know how you say it, a little tube, I guess, to cover it. Okay, and then he went to look for some wire cord to put, to tie the um, tube. So, okay, he do that. Okay, then we're ready to go. I turn it on. But this time, something else happened. The brakes didn't work. <laughs> so I'm like, what is going on? First is the motorcycle with the leaking, now is the brakes. So okay, so now we start looking for what's getting what's going on because the brake didn't work. So I see the front tire and I see that it's missing some screws. And which of them one was ripped off while I I guess I was trying to go on it and ride the motorcycle. So now he didn't have no screws. And it was getting darker. So, okay, we try to look for some. I go look for some, see if I have any. I don't find none. My friend do find some, but they were big, so they didn't fit it. So, it was another <laughs> bad thing that happened. <laughs> and to finish it off, after we did find some screws and put them on to finish it off it starts thundering out of a sunny day it starts thundering and it starts raining really hard so now what we had to do was wait until the rain gone was gone I mean <laughs> so let's say 30 minutes went by we finished like eating because it was raining so we go outside again just to find out that my motorcycle won't start now so I was just really disappointed at the end I didn't go why because my motorcycle didn't want to start so I could say yesterday was one of the worst days I had so that's all I wanted to <laughs> share with you guys I, th I think you guys had an experience the same that you was trying to do something and you didn't because of something. 
something didn't let you, I mean, like, probably you were trying to go to the beach and you had to go to school meetings or something, or you had to babysit and you couldn't go bowling with your friends. So if you had any stories that <laughs> happened that are almost the same as mine, I would love to hear them from you guys, and I will probably talk about one of them in the next video I do. So as you can see here, I just went over the spats, and now I'm using the HS10s, which are really good if you use them with a Kimbo attachment. As you can see, I will kill some people from far range with them. But yeah, another good uh, um shotgun I think is the Spaz 12. And I don't know, people say the suppressor doesn't do nothing to it, but I think it actually shoots far. And you should add a steady aim perk on it. I think it will be beastie. But as you can see here, I shoot this guy and I had to knife him. So I don't know. I don't know what he was using. I know he was using ghosts, but to like survive all those shot <laughs> shotgun bullets. Well, like I was saying yesterday was a bad day. Um it did happen before in another kind of way. But what happened yesterday was really it really did annoy me. Like, I was trying to go somewhere, then I had to fix something, then I had to fix something else. And then when we we're, were about to go, it starts raining, and it ruins it all. So now I had to go inside and just watch TV. Couldn't go on my... Mo and by the way, it is a mini motorcycle. So I'm pretty sure that you guys would love to get in one. <laughs> they really run fast and are super fun. So, yeah. Well, I hope you guys are enjoying these episodes with all gun kills. And stay tuned because Saturday I'm, I'm going to bring episode 4. And this time it's going to be, I think, light machine guns. So, yeah. And I hope you guys enjoy this gameplay. This one was one of the best ones I did with shotgun. So... Like I said, if you enjoyed the video, give it a like, comment on it. I really would like to hear from you guys and what you think about my videos or what you hear in my commentaries. And if I do get some feedback, I would really like it. So, yeah, guys, and I will see you guys Saturday with the new episode. See you later. Bye.